So it's now time for the announcement of the Ordnance Survey Award, and I'm going to hand over to Paul Naylor. Afternoon, everyone. Um, my name is Paul Naylor. Um, I'm a technical relationship consultant at Ordnance Survey and programme chair and vice president of the British Cartographic Society. And alongside Jess Baker at Ordnance Survey, uh, we are the judges for the British Cartographic Society Ordnance Survey Award. Um, the Ordnance Survey are extremely proud to support the British Cartographic Society in our sponsorship of, of this award. Um, and the award was originally set up to encourage excellence in cartographic design and the innovative and exciting use of Ordnance Survey data. And this year, the standard of entries was again really, really high, um, and it was difficult for us as judges to pick a winner. However, there was one entry that stood out amongst the rest. Uh, but before I do announce, uh, that worthy winner, I'd like to reveal who has received the honour of our one highly commended entry. And this goes to Ji Lan Zhu from the University of Leeds for his entry, Artificial London. Um, the judges were, were very impressed with the high level innovation uh, for this entry and liked how OS Master Map data uh, had been used to help generate satellite imagery using artificial intelligence. It's certainly an interesting concept and something as judges that we've never seen before. So well done, GLAM. So that moves us on nicely to the winner. Um, and the winner this year, the 2021 British Cartographic Society Ordnance Survey Award goes to Peter Bolt from Landfall and for his entry, Grin Gok. Um, as judges, we were very impressed with how visually engaging the map is. The use of lights marking the contour lines shows careful consideration given to the overall composition, whilst the raised elevation is a great way to bring a 2D map into the 3D dimension or the third dimension. The outcome is both innovative and very beautiful, and it is a worthy winner. So a huge congratulations goes to Peter for winning and to GLAN for his highly commended. And all it leaves me to say now is a big thank you to all those that have entered this year and I look forward to seeing next year's entries.